Oh, hi, Dr. Wallace. Yes, I want you to listen to something, please. Oh, okay. Fiona, Jerome and Haley just left my apartment, and might I say, I adore those it's two Max. lovebirds. They showed up with the new pages. <laughs> Bravo, my friend. Fiona, your courage, your bravery, in sharing the stuff that you did, wow. Oh, Max. Wow, this is gonna kick that book right up to where we need it to be. Also, I would like you to thank your mother for me. Her including those photos, invaluable. And might I also tell you, that was some rhinoplasty they did on you. Boy, oh boy, I had never seen a child with a nose like that. You can hardly even tell now. So but this is yeah. the kind of stuff we need in order to make that book something, so thank you. And you just remind that Haley and Jerome, next time they're in New York City, I don't want to hear about a hotel. No, I do not. They will be <laughs> staying with me. Haley, oh, adorable. She was so generous, so sweet, Max. How well, wonderful you're making such fast friends. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, she was with very... With someone that you have no business even speaking to. Oh, well, How no... How dare you not send me pages before you send them off to the publisher, Jerome? Oh, well, listen, I want to, I want to assure you that I talked up as much as I possibly could your contribution to the book. So don't my worry there. My contribution? It's my book. Right, right, it's right. It's not a contribution. Oh, absolutely. Yours is a contribution, a menial one. Thank you. How dare you? 